Pajama play with Molly. What is up, Pajama Squad? We are back again on Pajama Play with Marley Show. So I know that y'all seen that thumbnail and you read the title and you seen that we are about to do a what? We are about to do the Easter Twin Telepathy Challenge. So we are about to see if Marley can read Gia mind and we are about to see if Gia can read Marley's mind. So as the game, we're just gonna get right into this challenge. So as we um, do the challenge, you'll see how it works. All right, let's get started. All right, so I'm gonna put two items on Gia's side, and I'm gonna put two items on Marley's side, and we're gonna see if they can use their, their mind reading power. Let's see your mind reading power. Let's see, let's see. Let's see if Marley can read minds. Are you reading Gia's mind right now? Yeah, I think she wants out else. Gia, are you reading Marley's mind? Can you read Marley's mind? Okay, let's see if they can read each other's mind and choose the same thing. All right, so let's get started. So here we have the carrot bubbles and then we have some ducky bubbles. Now, Marley have to guess which bubbles would Gia choose. Comment down below if you think Marley would get this one right. Which one would Marley choose? She chose the carrot bubbles. Do you think Gia would choose the carrot bubbles? Did she read Gia's mind right? Let's see what Gia chooses. And she chose the ducky bubble, so Marley got that one wrong. <laughs> Which means she did not read Gia's mind right there. Round two. Okay, so now we have the purple egg candies and the yellow egg candies. Now it's Gia's turn to choose which one do she think Marley would choose? Okay, so Gia thinks that Marley would choose the purple egg candy. Let's see if Gia is right. Purple egg candies. Marley chose the purple egg candies, which means Gia got the one right. Gia get one point. The score is one to zero. Round three, now we have two different kinds of bunny headbands. Okay, so we have the full um, bunny headband and then we got the bunny ears. Now it's Marley's turn to choose what she think Jill would choose. She's doing her any, mini money mo. Okay, so she thinks that Jill would choose the full bunny ear headband. Let's see if she got this right. Oh look. She got it right. Gia has chosen the bunny ears. So the score is one to one. Round four. So now it's Gia's turn to pick which one do she think Marley would pick. Do you think Marley will pick the headband with the full bunny? Or do you think she'll pick the headband with the bunny ears? Let's see one. Okay, so Marley making her decision. Marley has chosen the four bunny ears, and Gia has got that one right. They're both putting on the same headband with the bunny ears, so the score is two to one. Round five. Okay, so now we have these cute little pink bunnies. So Marley has to read Gia mine and figure out which bunny will Gia choose. Okay, so she thinks Gia would choose the little pink fluffy bunny with the black eyes. Let's see if she got this one right. Oh, it looked like she got it right. So that's one point for Marley. Gia has chosen the pink fluffy bunny. She has read Gia's mind. The score is two to two. There's some powerful mind reading going on right now. Round six. 
Okay, so now it is Gia's turn to choose which blue bunny do she think Marley would choose. Will Marley choose the fluffy bunny or the big eye bunny? She's making her decision. She's reading Marley's mind. Okay, so she think Marley would choose that big eye bunny. So let's see if she got that one right. Oh, Gia has got that one wrong. Okay, so Marley chose the, the blue fu fluffy bunny. So the score is still two to two. Okay, so in here we have the chocolate candy and then we have the white chocolate. So now it is Marley turn to choose which candy that she think Gia would choose. And Marley has already decided that Gia is going to choose the chocolate candy. Now, which one you think Gia is going to choose? Did Marley get this one right? Let's see. She chose the chocolate candy. Marley has got that one right. So Marley gets one point for the score. The score is two to three now. Okay, so round eight, we have the gummies, the Hatchimo gummies, and then we had the Minnie Mouse gummies. So now it is Gia's turn to choose which gummies do she think that Marley would choose. So Gia is making her choice, any mini money mo. She is so adorable. Okay, so which one? Hatchimo gummies. Gia has chosen Hatchimo gummies. Let's see if Marley chose that one. Marley chose the Hatchimo gummies, which means Gia got that one right, and the score is three to three, which means that they are in a tie. They have passed the twin telepathy challenge, which means that they can read each other's mind. All right, guys. That and was it. Yep, that is it for our video. Our Easter twin telepathy challenge. Comment. Don't forget to, um, what do they need to do, Marley? Clap it down below. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, turn on your post notification bell, and drop a comment down below, hashtag pajama squad, and we are out. Who gonna close the video out? Alright Gia, do it. We are out. Can you open the...